Hello, hello everyone and welcome to a new episode of whatever this is. If you take a look around, we're in a new place. New place, new stuff, new stuff to see, holy, it's so good. As you can tell, I have created this monstrosity of a hotel. It's not done yet, ceiling it done. But I've also updated the pathways. I will show you a time lapse of it right after. I finished a few lampposts, pretty simple. I finished up the pathways, made it look cleaner, this is still in the way, I'll tell them to get rid of it. For the most part, the pathways are pretty good. But they still need a bit more updating, because they need some cosmetics. Here. I'm talking hay bales, uh, random cosmetics, I mean look at this. It's just on the floor. I will take all of the heads and I will update them to make them look a lot better. By the way, in case you're wondering, I am playing on, as you can tell on the side, Lyag Network. Playlyag.net. You can go ahead, you guys can go ahead and join me here too. All you have to do is just put in the IP and you're good to play. You'll see me occasionally in the tab section if you press tab. You'll know as soon as you see the YouTube tag. You guys already know that. <laughs> now that I've shown you what uh, the final product looks like at least, here is a quick time lapse of what I've done. Yes. And with all that you see, I'd say it's a pretty impressive, right? And, until the death. Oh, okay. Okay, get away from me. <laughs> death will die. <laughs> Good news is we're doing great. On this server, it feels much easier to do stuff. I highly suggest you guys join me here. Let's all play together. I highly encourage you to join me. Playlag.net. Here I have myself a little world map. I can go to it whenever I want and scroll around, but this world is full, and I mean full, of some weird, crazy stuff. Like, the generation alone will tell you that. But the features, the features that come with it, damn, do they make a really good server. So, I plan to ro run around a bit, expanding my little map pole. I can also tell you about the features of this place. So, 
in this server. We have a kingdoms based claiming system which allows us to essentially have our own piece of land. Just like me, I have joined the lioness kingdom and we have claimed this much. If I slash k map, you'll see every green dot is a lioness chunk. Each of these is a 16 by 16 chunk going from sky limit to down. And as you can tell, I mean, we're doing great. There's a lot more places to go to. And you can even like claim your own land, even if you're alone, it's fine. I love how you can just have your own land with or without people in it. If it's just you, no problem. If it's with a bunch of people, no problem. <laughs> we're all having fun. At the moment, there are a few kingdoms that are going around. One of it is Lioness at the top at the moment. <laughs> of course, you know. The others is Ivelat, some other peoples. There's uh, Wanderers. One spelled with W A N that are small letters. There's so many other kingdoms you can join. However, you can always make your own, even if you're alone. I used to do that back in season zero. I had nobody to be in my kingdom with me, so I ended up just playing on my own, making my build. I'm sure you. Uh, uh, there are a bunch of other videos on this channel. You'll see a few of the videos back in season zero. Uh, link in the description as well. Or nothing stopping you from going alone. You could be a mercenary. You could be a hammer. You could own businesses. Another thing about this server is that we also have a profession system. This profession system it relies on like four jobs. There's builder, me, as you can tell on the side. I am a builder. My fellow pals are fighters, farmers. And miners. You can only choose one job, so pick, uh, pick a poison. They all have their own benefits, and they all have their own disadvantages as well. I'm sure, you can tell. That's a, that's a diorite tree. That's a diorite tree. That's a diorite tree. And a granite tree too. It's polished and not polished. This world gen is unique. I love it. This seems to be a flower stone uh, stone tree biome. I call them stone trees. Let's call them stone tree biomes. With own customized trees. Obviously you can still plant the regular trees. But these trees look so much better. Oh, somebody blew it up. I could chop one of these down and make it a Christmas tree or something. Adventuring alone is already some cool stuff. Get to see some cool things and I killed myself. On top of that, their Discord server is very, very, very active. I highly suggest joining it. It will also give you the announcements and the patch notes each time. You know, balance changes. <gasps> cherry blossoms! I've always wanted to build one of these. There are cherry blossoms in this game, yes. Cherry blossoms! Oh, I love the ambience here. There's like random dots in the air. There's fallen leaves here. Look at this ambience. How big is this place? It's not very big. Okay. That explains why the woods dark oak, one of my favorite woods. I love it. It's bigger. Oh, it's much, much bigger. Looks like somebody's already settled here. Nobody seems to have claimed anything, but... This looks like an abandoned house. With a mining station. Interesting already. Looks like somebody's been here, but hasn't really committed. His name is TLPCZDBD, dude, this guy. Alright, that's been added to my markers. Either way, looks like we still have a bunch more to see. I'm loving these biomes already. Cherry blossoms. Later. By the way, we also have guns. Flintlock pistol. And I wasted a bullet. That should be enough for today, too. Let me show y'all something. All the way back at spawn. If you do slash warp market, you'll teleport a bit, give it time, and you're in the market now. Here at the market, you'll see we got a farmer's market where you can trade in farmer's stuff to get money. Yeah. And use the money to purchase most of your things. Here as well, you can sell out ores. If you're a miner, you can sell ores pretty imports this is where you get your free blocks or at least the blocks that you're rarely gonna find 
mossy, upsy, white concrete, white concrete, clay. I better buy all this before anyone else does. How much money? Yeah, I'll just keep buying it. I'm putting it out of stock. Here's the auction house where you can buy some random stuff, people selling. In the black market, you can find all the weapons with some gunpowder. Eight gunpowder for 4k, wow. And everything else that spawned is basically where you find your crates. Your... But most of it is in slash warp where you can just choose whichever you want you go to. Let's start with the crates because the crates is where you find the guides and the leaderboards. So this is the vote party crate. Every 40 votes, the vote party happens. And when that happens, you get to trade in your vote party crates here. This is the uh, pay to win version. Then we got the guides. You're going to love these guys because these are important. These are highly important. You'll find all your profession guides here in case you need to. Anyways, back to the tour. Over here, you'll see the leaderboards. It's pretty far away. Here we got the highest kingdoms. We got Lioness, Ivela, Sanctum, Meow, 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 SJC, Fallen, Wanderer, K23, Hydra, and Mammotest. Most of which I've never heard of. Here are the top voters. So far, it looks like nobody. And these are the wealthiest players at 300k. Meanwhile, I got only 15k. Did I forget? The final thing I want to show you for this is the inside of the hotel, as you can tell. That's a lot of heads. I, I'm, I'm not sure what that one is. No, definitely don't know who's this one's. Here's a sample apartment with a melon and an acacia. With four beds, four chests. Not bad. Everyone can have their sleep. If I go all the way to the top, as you can tell, there is no floor. Big sad. Soon enough. But that will not be in this video. It'll be the next one. Thank you guys very much for watching. This has been a, a great first, first look into the server again. Damn, is it going to be good. Look at this. We're going to make this place look even prettier than we did before. Those lampposts alone down there, they look amazing. That should be enough for today as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.